<laughs> oh, people. I've had some stuff going on lately, so... That's why I made a video yesterday and that. But, like, uh, I've got to address this Brian Harvey stuff, man. I mean, because I've just been talking on his live and then he's blocked me twice. Both fucking accounts, man. Brian, I was, like, supporting you up until this Tony Mortimer stuff, like, how can you expect somebody to, uh, just because you want them to go to the police, maybe they want to, like, not let people know that they've been uh, sexually abused, do they? Do you know what I mean? And, and now you're putting it on there because... It, yeah. <laughs> You're putting it on there just to make people feel sorry for you, man. There's loads of people going without kitchens. There's loads of people going without council work at the minute. And you act like it's all targeted towards you. It's all targeted towards you. You know what I mean? And the fact, you, you say, oh, what, what, why? The benefit stuff, right? The benefit stuff. I'll tell you what the benefit stuff is, man. I might. This is just my opinion. But like Brian Harvey, right? He, tr he, he tried to run himself over, man, because like uh, he day want to uh, get a normal job because he'd be recognised, wouldn't he? All over the place, look. Especially in the the fashion sense. You know what I mean? You're gonna know if Brian Harvey's serving you McDonald's, or you're gonna know if if. You know what I mean? He's like plumbing or whatever. You know, I've had Brian Harvey around my house today plumbing. And he, he, he can't stand that, man. He can't stand that. Because he's been put up on a pedestal so young. And, and now he, he, can't, he can't let go of the fact that he's just a normal bloke. <laughs> There's been loads of pop fans. That have, uh, people have ended up in the same situation, man. Everybody's against you, man. The fucking royal family. Are you having a laugh? Are you having a laugh? The, are you telling the truth about the Andrew Ash, Ash thing? Yeah, fair enough. It was dodgy, man. He was another Carl Beach. But yeah, I'm the one like going around saying like, oh, I've got a, I've got loads of cameras. I'll help you out, Bill. I'll help you out. You know what I mean? Putting yourself in there. So you've only got yourself to blame, man. And that's the facts. You fucking trying to force another bloke to like, come clean about having something done to him that you don't even probably want to talk about if it's true. You know what I mean? And and you've got the fucking... You know what I mean? You've got the front to, like, call that out. What the fuck, Brian, man? I thought you was a good guy and that, but... And, oh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to release it as well when you said about the ring about John Endy, man. I'm going to release the footage, like, the, the phone call about him being fucking propositioned. You want to take a long, hard look at yourself, man. Because for somebody who ain't been bombed, you're fucking acting suspicious, man. I think there's something happened to you in them rooms, man, for you to keep acting like this. Fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> Go and watch his skit, Harry Hudson, man. Look at the size of him compared to... Look at him. Fucking hell. Anyway, Brian, fuck it. I'll, I'll, I'll supported you for years, I have. But this, what you're doing now, like, blaming everybody's against you and that, man. Fuck off, man. Fuck off. You ain't that important, man. And the sooner you get that through your head, the better. Take care, people.